Welcome to the Padi demonstration of dual axis solar tracker system along with environmental parameters monitoring. So here we are going to control this solar panel positioning with help of the two servo motors in two axes. So this in x direction and y direction. So the y direction purpose is in a, uh, during the winter time the sun deviates toward the south side so that we need to track that position also. So then with the help of this extra servo motors and another two LDRs, we are going to detect the sun position uh, deviation towards the south side. And east to west will be identified by these two uh, LDR sensors. When the sun is moving in this direction, then it will move or uh, rotates the uh, solar panel from east to west. And the next when sun is uh, deviating towards the south and then these two LDRs will detect the sun position and then the below servo motor will track that sun position. And these two control with the help of ordinary you know and along with this environmental parameters the rain sensor will detect the rain intensity in uh, millimeters per hour and a THC double one so humidity and temperature so these three parameters continuously displayed on the LCD screen so coming to the interfacing connections we have interfaced these four LDRs at A0, A1, A2, A3 pins and A4 pin was interfaced to this rain sensor and the eighth pin interfaced to this DHT double one sensor and nine and ten to these two servo motors and LCD at pin number B22, B7. So the whole system run by this five volts power supply which is getting from this adapter. So which will take 230 volts AC and provide as a five volts DC. So that was placed on this breadboard. So you can see that this is the breadboard. So to distribute this five volts power supply throughout the input and output modules. So in our project input modules are LDR sensors, rain sensor, DHT double one and output modules are LCD module and two servo motors. So let us see the demonstration. Right. So if I stop the rotation of this solar uh, like a uh, flashlight then the rotation also will be stops. So if we go with this So in this manner we are going to track the sun position with help of input sensors LDS and output modules servo motors. So same thing like on the uh, display we can see the humidity and temperature. So if we place any droplets on this one so we can see the rain intensity on the LCD screen. So when I wipe out that. see that as decreases in a normal condition again so if I the if I blow the uh, air on this humidity sensor we can observe the increasing in the humidity right you can see that the uh, humidity also getting increased